Hello, Comanche Native here, and yes, this is old footage from Fallout 76 Happy Builder because Happy Builder is no longer available, but I went into Happy Builders to try to figure out what was up with the electricity, so please enjoy. Now, I did a couple of drawings, and I figured this would probably be the best way to test the radius of the electricity. So I have four lights in four directions, okay? And all I'm going to do is connect the power to the foundation to see what will happen. And I think possibly it could light the whole thing up. Alright, hang on. We're going to need a new connector. Wait. Right. Right here. You notice, look at that. It kind of like highlighted the lights all around. What? When did it start doing that? Oh, there we go. Okay, we have electricity on all four lights down here. One outage. So three lights lit up over here to the right side. Four over here. Three over here. That's weird. Same thing. Three lights lit up right there. Three here. But all of these are lit up. Now, is it because of the connector? Like, could the connecting position play a factor here? Now, I want to show you that I kind of line this up like this. And I think it might be because the connector is closer to the to the lights over here and not over here, which is giving us one outage right there. And you can see it. Look, hang on. Right there. See? No power. Hmm. Interesting. Now, I don't know if it's only because of Happy Builders that this is going on. Or if this is the new thing. Or maybe it's always been like this. But honestly, you know, I, I have used this generator before and it never did anything like this. I mean, really, it would make my life a lot easier to light things up. Okay, so I'm going to grab a hold of... Um, hang on. I think they have a different version of this light. Okay, there we go. And I'm just going to place this here just to say this is the outage. Okay. And then I'm going to run back up top and then do an aerial shot. Just so you guys can see the madness that I'm creating here. Now, I'm going to be limited with these lights. They will they'll kind of stop me. Okay, so I won't be able to put a lot of lights up. It would have been nice just to see. But, um, yeah, let's, let's get back up and do an aerial shot. Now, remember, keep this in mind, it's not set in stone, okay? Alright, hang on, let me get the drone out. Now, what do you mean by it's not set in stone? Well, they can change this. They can change this if they want. They could change it to where the electricity doesn't do this. They have the power, and I'm talking about Fallout 76 has the power to change all of this up. Okay, so I went over there and I put some more lights down just to kind of get the radius a little bit more. That looks so weird. It's a snowflake. Aww. <laughs> what am I doing? This is crazy. This is crazy. Okay, let's see. Okay, so we don't have electricity there, but we have it there. What? No, there's no electricity there either. I'm like, what? You know, when I was laying these down, I saw that and I was like, man. 
This is weird. Doesn't that seem kind of odd? I mean, I think it seems kind of weird. Okay, hang on. I'm just going to mark this right now. Like that. That's strange. I mean, I... I don't know. How come the pattern is not a full circle? We got outage where it, there shouldn't be outage. Well, in my opinion, there shouldn't be any outage here. But there is. And I'm like, hmm. What the? Okay, hang on. Let's get back up there. And let's take a look. Goodness. All right, hold on. Bam! There it is. I hope you guys can see it. But that is the outage here. Does that make any sense? I don't think so. <laughs> I mean... What is going on? I don't know, guys. That's not like a full circle, I don't think. Okay, I put some more lights down to the madness that I'm looking at here. Yes, it looks like an atomic bomb, but no, it's not. But you know what? That's not a, a circle. That is not a full circle. I mean, if I could put more lights down, maybe it would be. But no, no, no. Now, here's the thing. It has to do with the connection that is on the foundation that is causing this weird radius. So I'm going to go ahead and detach it and then move it. All right, hang on. Now, keep in mind, I said this once. I'll say it again. They can change this. All right, hang on. Let's see. Now, look at this. Look at it. Highlight the lights. Was that an update? Because, honestly, I don't remember it ever doing that. Okay, so I'm going to just go ahead and put it over here. And then we will see what we got. You know, now I can understand why it lit that last build that I did. You know, I had it attached to the outside of the, the house in the back. And then, you know, it lit up everything. Okay, hang on. Let's see. Let's pull out the drone. And this is what we got. Mm. Uh, kind of a circle? Maybe? What? What? Okay. Now, since I kind of noticed that it, it does a radius thing, now I'm thinking, how far off the ground can you put this? Because right now I'm just testing the flat area of the radius, right? Okay, let's see. Let's get the drone out one more time. And then we'll test how far off the ground it can be to light up the area. Because this is unusual to me. That does more than the radius. You know, the radius device that I was using earlier, that is more powerful and I'm like, wait a minute. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, let's see how high off the ground we can actually get this thing. 
because now I'd like to know. Hang on. About right there. Okay, it's still lit. Okay, not bad. About right there. How about that? Okay, that is like right on top of the generator. Kinda, sorta. Look at that. What? See, bring it over here. Yeah, it moves. Now, you know what? I wish, you know, my brothers were here with me. So they could just move this thing around and I could be on the very top just filming the whole thing. But, uh, no, no. Sad to say that's not going to happen. Let's see, right here. Oh, it kind of turned red. I guess it's too far. That is weird. Alright, you know what? We're going to have to get to the extreme on this. It's time to build it higher. No, really, like way up there because I can't really jump and then just like stay up there. So, let me get back up on the ladder and then build a little bit. Hang on, let me build it a little further out. And let's see how high, or I guess it would be the radius below that we're testing out here, right? So I guess how low the radius for electricity is. Hang on, I need to grab it. Okay, let's see. Let's bring it. How about this? Right there. Oh, it's off. Okay, too high. Too high. All right. Uh, okay, there we go. So bring it down a little. Right there. Hmm, no. Ah. You know what? There's got to be an easier way to judge the height of this. Um, let's let's get creative. Hang on. Let me see. Okay, we need to think in floors. Okay, so let me put some walls down. All right. Okay. Hang on. Go attach. You know what? Wait a minute, wait a minute. That's kind of hard to determine, right? Uh, we might have to make this a different um different template. Hang on. Just to make it a little easier on us, right? Visualize, visualize. Let's see. Let's go with okay, this, and then red barn, and then we'll go back to this, just so we can see. So about three, three floors up. All right. Okay, let's see how this looks. If I can get the camera right, hang on. I might, um... Okay, I had to move. Alright, there we go. Alright, so this is what we're looking at. Uh, hang on, there we go. Probably the third floor. I would say the third floor, that it, it's... On the third floor, maybe... Man, that is hard to see. You know, I do apologize. It is at night. It's probably the perfect time to try to show the lighting. But I just wanted to show you this. It looks like it's on the third floor. Maybe a little bit above. Let's put some flooring down. Because, you know, I'm just curious. I'm really curious right now. Like, how 
far off the ground can we actually be just for that that one little electricity okay yeah it's on the third floor that's what it's on like way up there yeah third floor okay well I need to get up there and try to get it to sit on the floor and maybe it'll light up the bottom let's let's say maybe it'll light up the bottom hang on can I just Whoa. extreme close-up right there we got a little bit of electricity down below well it's not really quite on the now I say third floor because the bottom foundation is actually the first floor second floor and third okay alright you know what I gotta get up there man this is weird and interesting it is it's like I'm doing an experiment here and I'm not quite sure if anyone really explored the electrical, you know, part of, uh, no, 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 I don't, I really don't want to, um, mess up any of the, the lights, explored the electrical part of each device, the radius, and then this, because I think this is a mistake. I don't I don't think it's supposed to do that. Maybe it's just because it's happy builders that it's kind of Hang on, let me get up there. Come on, I got ups. Either I got ups or I'll die. Okay, there we go. I I mean I'd fall to the ground. It would hurt, but not enough to to do me in. Oh. It's red. Okay, so right there, right. Hang on. Right. Right there. Right. Right there. Right. Right there. <laughs> Sorry. Right there. Okay. There. Now I'm going to say that is right on the flooring there, okay? It didn't like it because of the wire was getting in way uh, in the way of the floor. Hang on. Let me make this see-through. Oh, man. I should have made them see-through. Hang on, let me, um, let me get on the second floor. Okay, let's see, make this see through. Okay, so it does light down below, which is very interesting because you could possibly, you know, just hook that up to the generator and boom. Let's see, let's make it to the first floor you kind of see it light up a little bit you see that gray around the lights that's cool you know no one's been by which you know they probably look at me like what kind of build is that <laughs> I call it the I'm confused build <laughs> probably looking at me thinking man she's on some next level stuff <laughs> all right you know what I want to see I want to see um, if the position of the generator itself has any factor in this because I'm confused <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and grab this generator and then just kind of like bring it up into the sky with my magic powers but that's kind of cool you know just to see it do that and I'm just sitting here thinking like all the time I've been building I've never had it easy like this that's pretty easy mm -hmm. got me scratching my head going what doesn't match my notes like I was writing outcomes out you know like okay so if I do this and that what would this happen what you know I yeah 
that's what I do. I write outcomes like, maybe this will happen. Maybe that will happen. I know it's crazy, right? <laughs> and what it is is a guessing game. Like, if I guess it right, then the probability of guessing it right will be dead on. Does No, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> It's my mind. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put this up high and see what happens. Mm, hang on. Ooh, I'm so lucky. Ah, it's that wire. It's like I don't like the wire. Okay, we're going to set it up to about right there. Now, I know there is a limit to the connection, but I'm going to try to put the connector device right in the middle of the center block right there and we should have some outages because it's now in the center before it was kind of off ah doesn't like it okay too far too far right like a rubber band yeah It'll snap right back into your face if you stretch it out too far I got you I got you okay we bring down the generator and then Okay, come on. Don't fear. Do not have fear. It is just a little tiny drop. Yeah, it stings your feet when you hit the ground, but that's all. That's all right. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this, and we will put it right, right here. Hang on. There we go. In the middle. All right, so we're going to have some outages now because it is now in the center. Now, this may make it look like a circle. But let's keep in mind, okay? The last experiment I did was with the Sears build, right? I laid down the lighting there, and it wasn't a circle. This one right here is a different device. So this one... Maybe a circle? <laughs> Maybe? But again, it's hard to tell because I, I couldn't light up all the lights. Now, maybe I should have just made the whole thing like in a ring. You know? Try to, to make it in a ring. But I went with this instead because of the squares. You know, the squares on the, the foundation. That's the only reason why I went with this instead of trying to line them all around all the way around will I do this again no <laughs> no the answer is no no way why because it's driving me crazy like I'm looking at it I'm like yeah and um, you know I like playing games I've been playing different games and everything like this when stuff like this pops up it just really messes with my mind because I'm trying to to figure it out. Hang on, let me pull out the drone. Okay, so at this angle it kind of looks like a, a circle, right? With the outage anyway. But again, I, I don't have enough lighting to light the whole thing up. Honestly, the sides look kind of square. I'm just saying they look square to me. So it's not a circle. And I'm like, what? Now, you know what, I've, I've played games before where it was like um, RPG Maker, right? And you have a radius for the monsters, you have the radius for the lights, the radius for certain things to happen. Now, what do I mean by radius? I am talking about a ring of action. And right now, this ring of action is weird. It is weird. And if you ever did, like, um, role-playing games to where you you can make your own RPG, you kind of understand what I'm talking about, right? It's it's like when the monster sees you, finally sees you. There's like a, a radius ring around each monster. And they have their own intelligence, okay? They, they could either really see you good, they're either fast or slow. So the electrical radius here is, is something that I can't quite understand because 
it doesn't seem like it's a, a, a ring. It's not like a ring, a perfect ring. And normally there would be like a perfect ring. But um, that's a no. <laughs> Again, this is not set in stone. They can change this. They can fix this if there's a problem with it. You know, maybe maybe it's always been like this. And I'm just kind of noticing that because of Happy Builders. You know, making me look at, at certain things that were actually going on in Appalachia. I was kind of like, okay, wait a minute, you know. And I'm just testing where the electricity is and where it's not right now. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Well, if they keep it like this, that would be great. It would make building a lot easier, especially when you're piping in electricity. But then it kind of makes me think you probably don't need all the other stuff. You know, if this one, one device has this much strength for power. I know if my brother saw me, like, what are you doing? I, <laughs> I'm just testing something out. Hmm. Uh, okay. So it's kind of like there's an outage right here. Over here. And then down this way. And then over here. And then all of this is kind of blacked out. And then right here. And then there. Uh, it's... It's this right here. This little tiny thing. When did you start being that powerful? Like, honestly. How did... You know what? It's Fallout 76. That's... That's the only thing I can come up with. Hmm. Okay, hang on. Let me let me test something out. Hang on. Alright. So, I'm going to... You know... Attach... Another... Connector... Okay. Now, see this right here? I'm going to set this down in place of the other connector. Okay? Because I want to put the radius um, that I was using in the other builds. I want to put that down and see. Because this is really strong for it just being that. So let me scoot this over and then put this down in its place. And then I'm going to attach the radius that I've been using. Now, I'm not going to extend, like, um, I'm not going to use the pipes or anything like that to extend it out. Let me just get this electricity, hook it up. And then I'll just disconnect this. Okay, all the lights are off. Now, I'm not thinking that, you know, with the new connection, it's going to light everything up. You know, I know that this one connector uses the little pipes to extend out electricity to certain of uh, the builds and everything. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and get the radius ones that I used. I think I used that in the... Well, I used that in all the builds. I really did. Okay, hang on. Where? Okay, right there. Wait, I want to face it up so you could see the power going through it. Okay, right there. Okay, so we got power. No power. Hmm. Not that strong. Not that strong! Okay, power, power. No power. Okay. Hmm. 
so that's like well you know what the blocks don't really matter I thought for a minute that the blocks did matter but no I don't think they do because see like that's one block but then you got a power outage right on that one block foundation block sorry all right that's unusual okay hang on wait a minute so what's the point of these things if you have something that powerful right there and why didn't I know this <laughs> ahead of time come here electricity you electricity behave goodness see okay that's it guys I'm done again I will repeat this because I said it like a whole bunch of times this is not set in stone they could change all of this rework the program you know the radius ring and introduce a, a different element to it something like that <laughs> but um I don't know it could just be happy builders that it's doing this I'm not gonna test it in adventure mode just think of the resources I have to go through in adventure mode just to try to do this experiment there right okay so my question is this the generator that I'm using right now is about a hundred right and the lighting it fluctuates some require two some require one right so you have the 12 output from that one generator that I just showed you now I'm not quite sure how much electricity each light is asking for from the hundred generator because I can't really see it right here um hang on let's see is there nope I can't see it um okay so this one is asking one like it's it's asking one of the hundred you know generator that I, I got going all right so if you have a hundred generator and then that one little tiny device that's being that powerful what would be the point of having the other generators now I know yeah you're probably saying well they just didn't come up with it yet okay so you got 12 here and I mean like they didn't find the plans yet this is three and then this is five and then this one right here is ten and then the one I'm using is a hundred and then the next one which I didn't find by the way is five now it could be just for design sake and then this one is a hundred you know it could be design sake that well maybe they just don't want the same generators you know I'm just kinda like throwing that out there of the the reason why but it's all guessing games for me it really is because Mm. -hmm. This is interesting test though. And that's all it is. <laughs> this is Imaginative and I'll see you next time. <laughs>